In this video, I'm going to show you step by step on how you can deposit your coins on to crypto.com exchange or CDC for short. Now, if by chance you don't already have an account with CDC, I'll leave a sign up link down below. That said, let's get started. So right now I'm on the homepage of CDC and what I want to do is then click on dashboard. Then I'm going to go over here and click on wallets and then spot. After, it's going to give me a list of coins that I can deposit. But what I'm going to do is enter in the coins ticker symbol that I'd like to deposit in this search box over here. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to deposit BUSD. So I'll type that in right now. So BUSD. And when I do, I'm then going to click on the deposit button. After, it'll give me a address that you can see over here, which has been blocked out for privacy reasons that I'm then going to deposit my coins to. Now, before I proceed, I want to caution you to select the correct network of your coin or token or else it may be lost. You will really want to double check which network the coin that you're wanting to send is on. For myself, I know for sure that the BUSD that I'll be sending is on BEP20, so I'm going to click this drop down menu over here and then select BEP20. After, it'll then give me a wallet deposit address to send my BUSD to. So what I'm going to do is pause the video so I can send over 10 BUSD. I'll be back once I receive the funds. Okay, so I've just received the BUSD, which is why you can see this message over here, which says you have one incoming deposit for your review. And so I'm going to then click on add info. And when I do, it'll say that I I've received the 10 BUSD and what I'm then going to do is add info. When I do, a pop-up message appears asking me to select the wallet type. So for myself, it came from my own wallet, so I am going to select non-custodial wallet. I'm then going to click on add info and it's been completed. And then if I click on transaction history, we can see that I have the 10 BUSD that I had sent. So pretty much that's how you can send coins to CDC exchange. The process is the same for whichever coin or token. Just make sure that you select the correct network or else you may lose your funds. 